subscribe and press the bell icon to never miss an update from first post Hello and welcome. I'm Sheena Oberoi and today we at First Post are in conversation with Prakash Jha. Hello sir, welcome to First Post. Thank you very much. We're so Pleasure glad to have you today. Pleasure talking to First Post, yeah. Sir, what is your perspective about gender and treatment of women, especially in the film industry since you've been for a very long time? See, it always reflects as to how you treat your women in society. Hmm. And unfortunately, you know we have the power game which continuously goes on within a family within a society within you know a larger sphere of life and within professions within country where uh, this stronger tries to manipulate exploit and take advantage of uh, the weaker and uh, women considered kind of like you know and easier objects and weaker objects they are objectified and this is absolutely wrong you know and to use that uh, imagery to use that idea in movies in yeah. literature is wrong you know yes, it shouldn't happen absolutely. it should not be done i in my own way i do try uh to have female characters who are stronger who can question who have uh, opinions who have, who have opinions who are independent so can so, we say that gone are the days when women used to be quiet and you know they never questioned their husbands and through our films also we'd be able to see such strong what's already happening in the society the whole me too movement yeah. uh, saw that where yeah. like you know people um, openly talked yes. about it and it it had a tremendous effect and impact mm. and I'm, i think you know the terrible thing where women were being exploited it yes sexually exploited because uh, you know uh, you could award them some work or you can do or could award them some favors um they were in vulnerable situation and you exploited them that was terrible that should have never happened but you know i'm so glad that people began to talk about it people it came out in the open and um, hopefully things will slowly change So do you think that something which the Me Too movement has created there's a wave now where everybody is you know talking about what wrong has happened with them do you think that the discussion will remain in the society for long or it will fizzle out soon what is your take on well, it will remain in the society it, okay. it will constantly be spoken i mean it has always been there hmm okay you look at ramayan yes you look at mahabharat any epic any period any time the social psyche has always been present it's been there been there draupadi was used and exploited and humiliated but she didn't stay quiet true she took her revenge she brought about the mahabharat the battle of mahabharat yeah. she saw to it that it was destroyed the the perpetrators of these uh, um, heinous crimes were taken to task she used her own power to do that wisdom to do that you know do you think it's a good time for everyone whether it's, it's the time. actors directors producers There's so many digital channels look at your channel yeah. i mean <laughs> so many course. you know yeah. and i when they tell me that there are 22 digital channels coming to interview you today i say my god <laughs> do so many exist they do and they are all working and they are all people are consuming everything people are being influenced yes. by everything yes sure yeah. thank you so much sir thank you sheena thank pleasure you pleasure talking to you thank you same thank here you. thank you